All right, back here with some Subnautica. Mediacom seems to be briefly cooperating. So, way to get fucking banned, idiot. Why, why, what the fuck is with people in the first thing lately? It's probably the same dude, honestly. Good morning, it's nowhere near morning here, but uh, you can still have a good morning. Um, get a bunch of crap I need to sort out. Uh, some tasty boys. Put all these in here. Found a nice little cave, so I got a little bit more conductive material, like, well, not really that much. Um, got some more silver, though. Got a new radio message here. This is life pod seven. Coordinates <clears throat> attached. Pod is structurally sound, but the fabricators bust. Requesting assistance. Seven out. Is that not the Degasi guy? It's corrupted. <clears throat> transmission origin recorded to data bank. Oh, get get in the seat. There you go. Yes, hello. Systems online. Alright, where is our corrupted signal thing? Come on now, where where is it? <clears throat> yes, hello. Yes. Alright, so that one is handled. Pa Parker <clears throat> Who's the gas he had it at? I don't. What? Uh. What? <laughs> what just happened? It did not actually. Transmission origin. Stress it. Oh, so they. Oh, they. We only get text. Corrupted. Crew reported problems in their onboard fabricators. So low ecological activity. One kilometer west. Stern. Uh, <laughs> that one doesn't really help me right now. <clears throat> well, I found a code to a thing. Life pod four. That looks really close to the Aurora. Parker, no! Oh, I swear to God, everything is trying to piss me off today. Um. Poke cord stopped working. Like everything works except for the it doesn't spawn Pokemon, which is like the only thing that it does well. It immediately stopped doing after two days. Um It's snow is melting, so it's of course melting again into my real life habitat is uh is leaking again because my treasonous moron landlords um never fix anything ever, so that's great. I've, I've told them about the leaks above the kitchen uh, dozens of times at this point. Woo! And still nothing is ever done. Woo! Does this go to the crab snakes? What is that? Oh, is that that's another bite. Mr. Bitey Man. Ooh, these boys! I should get... You know, I'll just get a little sample. <clears throat> I can grow those later. Can I like get a sample of this crap? Can I kill them? These are according to the, the, the computer, these are plants by the way. They, they look like jellyfish. Parker! Parker! God damn it. <laughs> He's being really uncooperative today. you friend little friend I think I've scanned one of these before I forget what they're called there's no point to that cave though other than those animals <clears throat> yeah they're in the flora section for whatever reason <clears throat> even though the life forms they appear to be based on are in fact animals. I love these like unloaded chunks. The 
think we've been to this life pod before, haven't we? Yeah, we have. All right, I need to build the laser cutter so I can get into some of these. Though this might not be one of the laser cutter ones. We'll see. I've probably checked this before. Oops. I don't know what that was, but it was big. gotta be a way into a piece this big, right? No? It's gotta be. Maybe we should just swim inside. Excuse me. Excuse, excuse me? No? Okay. You say so? <clears throat> Hey there. Uh, I don't know if this is go inable. Ah! Door? Locked. But does that mean, like, it doesn't have a prompt like the other ones do? Is that a laserable door or not? I should just build the laser thing anyway. I forget what it needed that I didn't have at the time. But I probably have it by now. It's been a long time. Marwan started playing this and uh, didn't find the Seamoth uh, until after the Sunbeam thing. And that that's, that's kind of rough. Um, Biggest thing I did not like in um, Below Zero, I think I would have enjoyed it a lot more. I react. Oh, no, I already got that. I think I would have enjoyed it a lot more if I had a Sea Moth at some point fairly early in that. As early as in that as I did in this, that would have been very nice. Instead, I never actually got a Sea Moth in Below Zero yet. Sand shark. Yeah, yeah. I think this is where you're supposed to get your first sea moth from. Yeah, yeah. I'll probably have to. Once I get a lot more copper. I don't know, maybe I need to just do something other than uh, solar power, but um, <clears throat> I like to make a bunch more of those like water makey reactor thingies, um, the, the purifiers. The sand charts react so weird. They like, it's like they're on ground the way they like flop around like gravity is affecting them a lot. I don't remember what I need those for. I think they're just good to toss in the bioreactor or something. Oh, here's that big entrance to the crab snakes. Moo! Moo! Oh, it's a weirdly colored shale outcropping. I guess it was just the lighting. But... Violet Mew. Parker. I'm really not in the mood for annoyance today. Yeah. 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 30 seconds. Hey, Nico. Par 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 Parker. Parker. I can't see. Just sit. There you go. <clears throat> I like when you can see them just derping around, like the ground hasn't loaded properly yet, and they're just kind of derping around in space. Alright, 
let's see what we need for a laser door thing. Because there's no way I'm getting to the Aurora without one of those. There's just got to be all kinds of those doors. Um, here. Alright, batteries. Ugh. I'm so sick of not having battery things. To die, human. Yeah, yeah. What, 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 what was happening there? This lantern fruit thing seems fantastic. My other stuff, less impressive. Definitely not portable meals, though. Portability, definitely a low point. But uh, not really. That doesn't really matter. Because it's just kind of to feed me at my base. The other ones aren't mature enough yet, I guess. Alright, now we won't die, which is probably good. Alright, laser cutter. Two diamonds, battery, titanium, cave sulfur. That's pretty easy. I already got cave sulfur. Two batteries, or one battery, two diamonds, I think it was. It was definitely the diamonds that I was missing. I barely have enough diamonds now, even. <laughs> Layout for subnautical lockers. 10% food, 90% lockers, pretty much. Hey! So you can use an empty battery and it it magically becomes a full battery if you use it to craft with, so that's neat. I wonder if there's like any exploit to like that's just where that's just cheaper than making a new battery. Cause I, don't, I still don't have the stupid charger. Um, store all oh, right. I'm gonna need so many titanium lockers. I just 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 all of it. Mouse, no. Uh, battery. Well, frame rate, please. Game, what are you processing that is doing this? Game. Game, chill out. What the hell? Game, what, what is your ordeal? What? What is it doing? Pop that down to medium. I thought I was on medium. No, leave the sync on. Hey, son. Plump. I love the like billions of tubes. Um. So I guess this one I don't even need the sea moth for. But what's behind door number one? Oh god. Oh god, this is gonna eat so many batteries. Oh no! This better be worth it. Shouldn't I have like a welding mask for this, by the way? That looks safe to like go through. Shouldn't there be like a rush of steam from that? Alright, you wanna cool down a bit? Oh, Mr. Radio, I'm doing things. There we go. Battery charge! <gasps> it was right here the whole time, oh my god. Thank god. Oh, 
This is the piece I've been lusting after forever. And it was right here. It was right here. Literally 20 meters from my base. I just hadn't built the, the thing yet. There we go. Right, now, I, now I can waste all the freaking battery I damn well please. This is this is so bright. I I I I almost feel like I should have a welding mask like in real life. Realistically bright. Hi, Barker. Thirty seconds. Yeah. yeah. All right, I'm gonna go make one of these like right the hell now, because I have so many batteries to charge. Hi, Barker. Oh, there's like a temperature meter. That's neat. I never noticed that on the Sima. I wish this game had night vision goggles. Yeah, and you genuinely go blind if you weld something with them on. Um, so how... It's gotta be one of these things. No power. Ah, oh, son of a butt. But Parker, would you chill your body pipes, please? No more of this after I'm done here. Battery charger. Wiring kit, copper, titanium. I can do that. Copper, need more copper. Those. Little bit of titanium. Alright, wiring kit. Oh, two silver. Wiring kit. It'll take a while to charge. Probably, but like. I have, like, I have to, I'm gonna get started now, so whatever. My, my intent was to kind of just put all of the, like, utility wall things on this wall. It's kind of ugly, but whatever. Works. Easy to find. Oh, thank god, it charges four at once. Parker? Where's the batteries? Okay. Parker, would you like not be here, please? I'm using the preview of the game in OBS. All right, battery. Eh. Battery, battery, battery. Let's see how fast this charges. It'll do, it'll do fine. How many more batteries do I have? Eh, just that one for now. Hey, boy. Get in this thing. So now we can explore all those big wreck chunks that uh, are the laser cutter doors. All systems online. It feels like we must be getting reasonably close to being able to at least do a little something in. What even is physics? Um, in the Aurora at this point. Lightweight, high capacity tank. Ooh. That sounds good. Oh, water. Oh, just more of these. Eh. Oh, right, I just took the freaking battery out. Um. Why does this person have like an artistic drawing of, of like their girlfriend? Like, it's not a photo. Got some documents. Some impressively waterproof documents. That is, those is, that is some strong ass paper right there. They should patent that. Hey! Now we can make, um, we can make that Seamoth thing. And a better tank, I think, and some other stuff, probably. Wait, could you just swim in here this whole time?
Oop, no, no, what are you doing? Thirty seconds Yeah, yeah There's gotta be something in here, right? I guess maybe not if this is this is probably the part you're you can access without anything special So it's probably not anything good All right, it doesn't matter I might still need to make a few more batteries because like that way I can always have a fresh set popped in the charger. Uh-oh. Um Is it please tell me it's at least nighttime. It is. The base has some battery power problems. I think this thing uses up quite a lot of power. sure what to do with this room yet but I figured I would just build up because my my base the terrain's too like uneven here to like do a lot of stuff um, all right. insufficient power oh oh recharging the batteries is probably draining it really bad whatever back to switching out batteries every three seconds Computer chip, diamond, lead. I just barely have enough for that. Diamond, lead. The computer chip needed gold and a coral sample, which I have, but I forget where I put. There we go. I have, I have some more diamonds. Let's kind of put some random crap in this thing. Quartz there. Some titanium there. Hey, Master Sword. I'm doing pretty good. Though, does anybody else have a Discord server that has Poke Cord in it? It stopped working for us today, and we don't know why. It was working fine for two days, and then all of a sudden. Um, I wonder if I should just, like, take these out. I'll just charge one at a time for now. Wait, it's nighttime. It doesn't matter how many are in there. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, I should just build that dang bioreactor, shouldn't I? What do I need for that? Bioreactor lubricant wiring kit. I can do that. Uh, in theory, I don't have the power to get right now. Uh... I know I made lubricant and put it somewhere. I'm gonna have so many, I'm gonna, I bet I'm gonna have like a hundred lockers or something by the time I'm done with this. I know I put lubricant somewhere. Oh, it doesn't matter, there's lubricant right outside. I could have sworn I made like 10 units of it, but whatever. All systems online. This is a pretty solid place for a base, honestly. It's kind of in the middle of everything. Um, we got the kelp forest right here, so I can get any creep vine samples or stuff. <laughs> I do that so often. I should probably eat a med kit. There we go. Why did that one only have one? I guess I only need one, but still. It's the principle of the thing. I'll get a couple more. Just because, and I'll make it, I'll make it in the, oh, it's daytime. It's probably fine now. Apparently there's a command to post the po Pokecord Discord server invite. Yeah, there is. There's a lot of self-promo commands in the bot. Also, I should fix this thing. <laughs> I think there's certain things that can kill the Seamoth instantly if it's under 50%. Why does that, why does that Spadefish hurt so much? That's, did you see that? That did like 15 damage. 
I'm definitely I, I can't leave this thing without without repairing it. Um uh, I think I stored it. Which I shouldn't do, I should just keep it with me. I think I stored it because I ran out of batteries. Yes I did. Come on now. Come on now! There you go. Okay, see now we're fine. I just started the battery charge right at night time. Okay, so make some lubricant. More lubricant. Uh, was it a computer chip or a wiring kit that I needed? Wiring kit. Wiring kit. How big is it? Big. Okay, I'll put it on the new on the new floor then. Bioreactor. Wait, what the? Where where can you even put this thing? Does it need its own room? Center of her room? Oh. Uh, I don't think I can do that with my current layout. Hmm. Crap. So it needs a multi purpose room all to itself? What a greedy thing. Do I even have enough titanium for a multi purpose room? automatically climb the ladder. Uh, let's just get all the titanium I can carry. That sucks though, because like I was going to build this base like up, but I can't do that. Oh, whatever. Uh, so you can't make the multi-purpose rooms kiss, huh? There's no reason I couldn't build it here. The, the, this game is weird sometimes with where you can build. But I'll just start building off from this level, because this level is nice and clear in every direction. I should have built more up, I guess, because like, I thought I would be able to build out on the ground, because it seemed reasonably clear, but I guess not. Epic Game Store has like good free games every couple weeks, at least for now. Um, they, I think it's still Axiom Verge. Axiom Verge is really good, um, but yeah, this is no longer on there. Uh, here we go. Uh, ba -ba -ba, bioreactor. Huh. Did I not make a wiring kit? Why didn't I take it? Whatever. I was kind of hoping to have most stuff done on one floor. Parker! Aw, thanks. It reminds me, I need to get a nice clean shot of the base for like... Um... Uh, for thumbnails. Mew! How do I like... Muse it? Parker, do not stand on that! I really like that it raises your thing by a lot. 
That'll just help me store more solar power, honestly, and I'll probably won't even need to use it as much now. I'll take that. Yes. Yeah. No, do not do that. Sorry, Parker's being really fussy today. Tasty boys. Oh, I don't have any Reginalds. I think what you're supposed to do, right, is like get a bunch of Reginalds and feed them into there. And like, if I get alien containment, so I think I can like breed Reginalds and like just get crazy amounts of power. Uh, let's just toss these in there. Let's see what that gets us. How do we tell like how much it's getting? Regular aquarium? I have one Reginald. Because I don't have alien containment yet, I just have the aquarium. Ocean bed. 250 meters? I can do that. No problem. Uh, let's make this modification bench. Where was that? Here it was. Oh yeah, I was gonna make a computer chip before the power went out. Uh, computer chip. Mr. Computer chip, where are you? Uh, copper wire. I'm kinda glad the bases don't have realistic physics. That would be a real pain in the booty. Um, oh, probably don't have enough space. Oh, oh, it's pretty small. Oh, that's nice and compact. I like that. Just put it right there. There we go. Survival knife. I already got that. Lightweight, high capacity tank. What's the difference between these? I don't know. I guess this one just lets you move faster, but this one has even more space, right? I'll just go for the super high capacity. It's really a big deal. I can make both eventually, but I'd rather have this right now. Fin, ultra glide fins. Lithium, rubber, I think I got rubber somewhere. Uh, put my lithium. Oh, dang, I'm like out of lithium. Uh, oh, this is where I put the loop. I forgot this was even here. Um, I need to get more rubber soon. Oh, right, I gotta take off the fins. There we go. Web speed considerably. 180 seconds. Nice. Uh, what else can I make? Cyclops upgrades. Can't make that. Don't even. Exosuit. Prawn death module. How do I make the Seamoth module Mark 1? Is that probably. Uh, that's probably in the. This thing. Um. Yeah, this thing. Computer chip can- ugh. I need so much damn copper. Always with the copper. Uh, conductive. Shit. Out of copper already. I can make the 
wiring kit at least. Wait a minute. Wait, what do I need again? Reader chip copper wire. Oh, I can do that then. I think. Oh, wait, no, because I need two copper wires. Better place with like lots of copper. Oh. All systems online. Oh. Right. Get those batteries first. Um. Some place with like tons and tons of copper. Man, <laughs> I shouldn't have made that second power cell. I hope I need that at some point. Because for right now, it just feels like I wasted two batteries, really. Put that in there. No battery, no battery. Oh, no, not you. No, go away. charged up. $43,000 gaming PC. What is that like? Was it have like 18 graphics cards? Got any of that copper? Oh, I just fixed this thing, guys! Come on! Unbelievable. I swear these fish just do not want to live. Whatever. What's up, Sharky boy? They never give me water, or er, water, oxygen when I want it. Why did this guy follow me this far? Go, go away. Don't you have better things to do? I need to collect stalker teeth at some point. So I can make that fancy glass observatory thing. Better be water cooled if it's like, you know, a billion dollars. What are you doing in here? Whatever. Oh, yeah, let me check the cave while I'm out here. Where is it? Ah, oh, fuck you. Yeah. Why do I even bother? He didn't even have sulfur. I'm taking your baby for that. Prick. I hate those things. <laughs> somebody posted in Discord. Um. Ugh. Could somebody find that? There was a... There was a fitting image of the mindset of a, uh... Crasher fish. What the hell was that? It sounded very mechanical. Intel core 9x16 cores. Liquid cooled and overclocked. I mean, that, that's kind of a given though, but like, what else does it have? It should be multi CPU for that kind of price. 
No. No. Do not. Do not! I hate those. I hate those a lot. It's so weird they're so common in like the beginner, like, easy baby area. In fact, I've had more... I've had less trouble with HP since leaving this area because Crasher Fish have done probably 80% of the damage I have withstand, withstand, stood in this game. Two NVIDIA Titans. That's like, that's like 4,000. That's only 4,000. How, why does it only have two? You could easily buy like, you could genuinely buy like 10 Titans and have budget to spare with that kind of cash. No, no, I need that. That is not tasty meals for you. Right, let's just go to this stupid thing. I'm all turned around. Here we go. This guy's really far away. Oh, hold up. I really need copper. Oh, and it's not copper, of course. This, this PC really doesn't sound like it actually justifies that price tag. Which obviously is a pretty high ask. Ooh, is there any... Doors to open? No, I don't think so. <laughs> 2,000 watt power supply, sure, sure. It's not even... Super crazy, I mean... If you were to do four graphics cards, you definitely need some. Ah, oh, shit. Oh. Damn it. I left my radiation mask at the thing. I should have figured. It looked like it was pretty close to the uh, Aurora. You know what? Whatever. We'll, uh, we'll get close to the Aurora for the first time this way. Stop that. Look at me, I'm a fish. I'm gonna kill myself. This fish must be millennials. Oh, here's the cave I was looking for. Oh, and it hasn't respawned yet. Good. Cool. Well, I'm gonna get this one at least. Uh, if I can freaking see it. Ooh! Can I phase through the world again? If I try hard and believe in myself, I can go through some of this geometry. It's happened before. Bring your own weapons. I've only done this once before. There, there it was. Oh. <laughs> like, none of the stuff that you're listing off, son, sounds remotely worth that price. I would say a PC one-fourth of that price would have pretty much the specs you're listing off to me. I don't... I don't understand this creation. Oh, do I have enough space to finally bring this... To finally bring this thing home? Uh, maybe. There we go. I love this thing here forever. I don't really need it unless I need to build another Seamoth. But, uh, may as well take it with me. Uh... Uh, crap. Take that too. <laughs> this <laughs> this creepvine C cluster has been here the entire time I played this game. I dropped it on like the first day because I didn't need it. It's still here. I should just pick it up and use it sometime. Triple water cooling loop with three pumps, five meters of hard piping for the eight liters of coolant to flow through. So I don't think like, I can't imagine even the fanciest, pantsiest water cooling system in the whole world is gonna cost like $10,000 on its own. Table coral isn't that valuable. Oh, copper is though. I 
feed it to the generator. Eh, might as well. I should probably like put a hatch on something here. Right, no, get out of that. Oh, don't have quartz. Can I even like no? Is that the sound of the bioreactor or somebody like taking a pee into a cup? Huh. Take that. Oh, no, I won't. Oh, no, <laughs> ladders are the hardest thing in the universe. Um. this uh, I guess this has to be on the surface doesn't it whatever bye <laughs> oh. <laughs> I hate when I do that I do that like all the time I was trying to make before? I have that. I think I have all of those. Uh, this thing! Computer chip, computer chip. Alright, so just need gold. And some more titanium. Always need more titanium. Mr. Computer Chip. Mr. Copper Wire. It's so rude that it takes two copper ore for a copper wire. Alright. Let's pop this bad boy in here. Pop this bad boy. Oh. Really? You say so. It's like, why is it like, huh? Okay. Uh, where did I put the seam on? Welcome aboard, Captain. Can you like upgrade the moon pool to auto fix your thing? Court's supposed to be posting in general. Uh, that's probably a side effect of it. Is it like actually working now? But no, it's probably a side effect of me kicking and removing it again. Still not posting any things. Let me just turn off the stupid level up things. Ugh. This should really just be a oh, whatever. It's not. It's a pretty shittily made bot, frankly. It's a cute idea, but there's so many dumb things that it does. Messages are disabled, period. What does this say? Fully charged. Yes. Fabricator. Ah, here we go. Engine efficiency module. Hello, 
full reinforcement. Oh, shut up. Vital signs. Hey, Tap Tap, you should try not to die. Vortex Torpedo? Oh, but those are consumables, aren't they? Toxic gas. Gas pod. Oh, do you get those from the gastropod things? Prawns, I don't, I don't have a prawn. <laughs> Torpedoes, sea moth modules. Ah! Okay. Just some glass and ingots. Got it. In got it. Ah, you are not the fabricator, you good sir. Uh, some glass. Unfortunately, the TGC bot, I would have to like install on my server and like figure out how to get Discord webhooks working and stuff. All right, now we can dive deeper with the sea moth, which will be incredibly welcome, actually. First, let's see what it takes to upgrade that at the modification station. Plasteel ingot. I don't believe. Which is a shame because I have plenty of rubies. Plasteel ingot. Let's see if I can make that. Plasteel ingot. Titanium ingot. Oh, I can! Uh, I might be out of lithium though. Ah, uh, shit. Lithium. There was a bunch of lithium with that mushroom thing. Torpedo system. Sonar? Ah, but copper. Advanced wiring kit. Solar charger. Hey! Ah. I don't really run out of power too much, though. Some of these are neat to have, but, like, I... Uh, it's just... Um, because I don't have a lot of copper. Uh, I'm just gonna shove all this in a thing. I'll sort it later. Grab some f water. Uh, let's cook some tasty boys while we're at it. At some point, I'll bother making cured food, but like later. Uh, gear. find that life pod that is surely empty because every single other life pod has been and now we can even take the sea moth directly to it there's been so many things that are like just annoyingly below sea moth crush death I just love being able to breach. I'll be sad if you can't breach with a submarine, despite how stupid that is. A mystery dungeon bot, really? Huh. Hey, 
Hey. I wonder. Yes, gas pods. So that's how we get gas torpedoes. How do these like not pop just because I like touch them with my gross hands? Don't fart on my sea moth. Give me some more of your, your, your fart tubes. Excuse me. Ew! Oh, do not touch the booty. It's very... It's green, gross stuff. Alright, so gas torpedoes are pretty cheap to make then. I just need to steal from this guy and... Um, I hope that's not damaging the Seamoth. I uh, just need to steal these things and... Uh, some titanium. That's not bad at all, then. I should probably, like, drop these off at, like... Where's my thing? The life pod. Is that around here somewhere? Oh, it's right over here. It's too far to bother. I'll just drop them if I need the space. They're easy to get. Oh, wait, what's this? Nothing? What the hell was that? Wait, stop that! Stupid fish bumping into my thing. What was that sound, though? I didn't like that. Easy to find quartz out here. I want to make a big glass section just to appreciate. Oops. Those freaking spade fish hurt so much. Um, just so I can appreciate the sea around me and stuff. But uh, to make the real, the fancy boy observatories, I need the uh, teeth. And you can get the teeth pretty easy, apparently, if you, for the stalker teeth, which you need to make enamel glass. Oh, right, because I have the radiation. Well, it's not really avoidable, so whatever. Oh, hey, like a forklift thing. I doubt that's, like, relevant for me to scan, though. No. Yeah, so there's probably better bots. Like, there's, there's this Pokeverse thing that seemed really... Ooh, table! Um, that seemed neat. And it seemed a lot more detailed and stuff. Got anything in here? No. Okay. Did I scan that? Oh, yeah. All right. Uh, where did I put that? Oh, there it is. The Pokeverse sounds like it. It has most of the features that. Um, Poke Cord is missing, like it's got, I think it's got full 6v6, it's got breeding and stuff. Uh. Oh, oh, whoa, hello, hello Poppin, how you doing? Uh, this is where all that lithium was. Maybe we should find we could find some lithium all around here too. That's not lithium, is it? That's not salt. Um, I was getting worried. This was the place where we found the um, that big thing that ate my first sea moth. Is this the same mushroom forest, or is this a different one? Seeing much lithium, but oops. Only problem with Pokeverse, they only seem to only be up to Gen 4. Oh. That's a shame, but I guess it's probably more work, whoa. Than uh Poke Cord, because Poke Cord is just like bare bone stuff. Basically just scraped directly from Bulbapedia, it seems like. I don't think they do any real effort directly beyond that, honestly. 
Ooh, what is that? Surpassing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. What is that? What is what is what is that? I don't like that. I don't want to. I don't want to be out here with that. What? What is? Th oh. I don't. I don't want to be near that thing. Oh, whoa! Holy shit, there's so many bad things here. Ah, oh, but these like bulb things. Whoa! Oh, hi! Oh, you triplets! How are you doing? You must be the young one. Haha. <laughs> um, shit. Um. I like the orbs. Everything else can go die in a ditch. But I like the orbs. I don't like that. Detecting volcanic activity. Ooh! Several unusual electromagnetic signatures in the region. Exercise caution when diving deeper. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. Repulsion cannon. Sounds good. I'll take that. I'm not really a doctor. I know that's what my ID says, but I never have been. Cheated the medical exams. What does a doctor these days need to know about manually resetting bones? When was the last time a top surgeon actually cut someone open? That's what the robots are for. Doctors these days read diagnoses off of computer readouts. For that, I'm perfectly qualified. But what good is it when I'm not connected to the main network? I'm bleeding. I've got glowing green pustules growing on my hands. That I've got a self-scan and it tells me I've got skin irritation. <laughs> the only thing I studied in medical school was how to lie convincingly. What the hell do I know about how to treat an alien disease? I think I'm actually going to die down here. Rest in peace, Doc. Integrating new PDA data. Dare I try and scan that shocky thing. I think I dareth. Just barely. Well, it doesn't matter if you save. Okay, I don't I don't dare actually. Maybe I dare. It doesn't seem that aggressive. See, he's fine. Ampiel! He's got a cute name, he could be a freaking Pokemon with that name. Oh god. Do you, what, you more, you more a Digimon fan? That's okay, I respect that. I respect your incorrect opinion. See, he's fine! Just don't touch him. Can I scan the big ones? It's called the big one, Bitey. Alright, let's get out of here. Alright. This place seems like a place to not be right now. I kind of want to go into that big ship piece. Assuming I can ever find it again. Ah, here we go. Alright. You got anything good? No? Basic plant pot, thanks. You know what? It's new. Worth it. Uh, new kind of chair? No. Oh shit, is it eating my sea moth? Do not eat my sea moth! Oh shit! Oh god, guys, do not eat this. I'm sorry, Seamoth. Look, it is worth it. We got a plant thing. We can grow plants, Seamoth. I'll rub some herbs on your wounds. How about that? Whoa. Pretty. Oh, they got like big old mushroom roots. Oh god. Why are you still, why are you here? Go away. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh god. 
fix it, 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 fix it. Okay, fixed enough. Run. Why did they chase me? Go away. It doesn't taste good. Thanks, Big Will. All right. All right, let's try that again. There we go, good as new. Did I scan one of these glow rays before? There's nothing behind me, is there? Okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I think I did. You are pretty. Oh, I, I need the eggs for one of those things. I gotta have a pet one of those things. Y'all gonna need that lithium? Um. Um. Shit. I'm getting really good at switching batteries, at least, which is more awkward than you would think. I doubt that's the egg of the glowy thing, but I, I it's hard to tell. Transmitter fragment! That sounds, that sounds really important, actually. Power transmitter. Oh! Oh. That kind of transmitter. That is still really important, though. Because I can make, like, geothermal things, and then, like, put them, like, transmit the power. It's like Tesla's wireless power idea, basically. You can, like, build reactors away from your base and transmit the power in. Take a quick sip of air here. Is that what Sam was talking about? Yes. That's the power transmitter thingy. I was thinking, like, a radio transmitter to, like, tell people, like, to help me not die, but th this is good, too. Maybe that's the raise egg. When I was in the other mushroom forest area, it, um... I had a lot of lithium all over, but this one... Not so much. Just lots of creature eggs. Hmm. I haven't seen any lithium here. Everyone else is too busy with their own problems, such as being dead, to talk to you. That does seem to be the case. I'm, honestly, I'm calling it. There's no one else alive on this planet that, like, genuinely survives the game. This just, that just doesn't seem to be a thing. What the hell is... Oh, there's a big chunk over there. Some really high-pitched dolphin... Noises, I guess. Can't figure out how you don't use the sea glide. I got the sea moth. It's like way better. And it doesn't take up an ass load of inventory. Oh, whoops. I like my inventory space. That's why I brought this in instead. I was thinking. I need a light where I could take either the sea moth which has or glide which has its own light or I could just take the flashlight. I was like, you know what? It's a long ways away. I'd like to have the space. There's another kelp forest over here. Um, but there seemed to be a wait, shit. Where was it? They look like a big old chunk of the ship somewhere. In the distance. Ah, there it is. Nah, just a little sand shark. I'm not scared of you. I've been gnawed on by much bigger sharks than you, my good sir. You are nothing to me. Barely even a shark. More of a piranha, if anything. Uh, 
It's gotta be goodies in there. I'll oh, screw you. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen oh. Oh no. Oh no! Bad place! Bad place! There we go. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe. Okay. Um. No. I I think you're supposed to go in there from the inside. Lame. Oh. Well. I actually don't want to leave the sea glide near the plant things. They might break it. I mean, everything else seems to want to eat my sea glide. So why not the plants? Uh. How do we cut into this particular tin can? Here we go. No signal, huh? Battery charger. I already got you. Thanks for trying, though. Huge chest just for a single bottle of water. Get in there, huh? Picture frame. Ooh. Eh. No, that can't be it though. There was that. Uh, there's a PDA in there somewhere. Be another way in there then. Mm. Oh, speaking of propulsion cannon, um, that isn't like the solution to this, is it? Like, do I need to use the it's a gravity gun, come on. Uh, do I use the gravity gun to like clear that rubble out of the way? Or is there potentially another way in here? So I wanted that PDA and it doesn't want to let me in here through the obvious route. Not really, just push the stuff away. Then there's gotta be some way. Passing 100 meters. To get in here. Hold on, be right back. All right, I'm gonna give this one more look over because I really don't want to miss a PDA because I really like in the story in this actually um, It's got a lot going on but um, Not sure What I'm missing in regards to getting in there properly I like oh Here we go, maybe no Ooh, oh, oh, okay. No, no. Game. You gotta be shitting me, game. 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 
Game, this is bullshit. You, this is game. This is filth. Oh. I'm upset. How, d how dare this game play me like this? Are you seeing this bullshit? Are you seeing this? This is not how physics work, game. You. Oh. I'm actually upset. <laughs> wow. Um, where's the sea moth? I need to breathe. Oh, wow. That. Wow. That's just where we went in. Alright, hold up. Where did I put the sea moth? There it is. I'll try going in the front way again, see if there's like weird. Maybe there's some like side corridor I didn't check out. Don't think there. Oh! Oh! Maybe there is. Some paper. Some... Whoa. <laughs> Gently scanning a plant shelf as like. Disturbing reactor noise. Okay. That looks safe to be in the water. Oh, god damn it. Uh... Why is this so intense? We don't need a link. We don't need a thing about posting links without permission because um, you genuinely can't. Um, YouTube does not allow you to post links, period, without being a mod. Which is kind of annoying. I would like to let people be able to do that, actually, but. Yeah. Oh, wait, this is just gonna be two Titan games. Cool off. You would think it would cool fast underwater. Now we finally get the thing. Oh, that wasn't even a PDA. That was like important. Inventory full. I think that was a repeat. After all of that, I think that was actually a repeat of an item I already got. Let's drop these gas. Wait, those aren't gonna explode, are they? Okay, I don't think they are. Oh, they did! <laughs> they did! Cool! Battery charger. Just more battery chargers. Propulsion cannon! Hey, there's our fake gravity gun! Alright. I'll actually take that water because I'm dying. And I need to go breathe really fast. Well, it wasn't a total waste of time. I think that data core thing might have been a repeat because it said inventory full, so I don't even know what I was supposed to get. But um, we got some new things. I haven't been to the Aurora yet. Probably should soon-ish. Um, but I don't know what all items I really need, so I've just been following the, the radio signals, really. What the hell is that? Well, it's on the way home, so we might as well check it out. Certain things don't seem to respect the should you be able to see this far calculation. It's usually shit pieces. Hmm. Hmm. 
real quick. In, out, real quick. Because I don't want those things to eat my sea moth. Um, hello. Yeah, son, you become a mod in this thing just by, in this channel, just by be around a lot, show good judgment, be, you know, be a human, don't, don't be stupid. Hopefully pretty standard stuff. I don't need that. None of that was relevant. No, whatever. They didn't eat my sea moth, so Welcome I'm gonna call that a success. I found a new PDA, so that's honestly that's that's what matters. Uh, PDA. Here we go. I'm uh, not really a doctor. Wait, no. I know what? That's what my ID says, but I never have been. Cheat the medical exams. What does a doctor these days need to know about manually resetting bones? When was the last time a top surgeon actually cut someone open? I don't I don't know what item I just got. These days, I just got a PDA, but it's not readers. Oh whatever. For that, I'm perfectly qualified. But what good is it when I'm not connected to the main network? Alright, we we already heard you, bro. I'm bleeding. I've got glowing green pustules growing on my detect detecting volcan detecting volcan no, whatever. activity and several unusual. Electromagnetic signatures in the region. Exercise caution for dying. Oh, yes, hello, Parker. Thanks, yes. Par Parker? 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 Yeah. Hi, yes, hello. Thanks for sniffing my face. Oh, sorry, buddy. Why do the stalkers sound like giant sharks when their behavior is more like a really lazy crocodile that really only eats like tin cans? I know, Parker, I know. Uh, home? Where is home? Psst. Yes, I can tell that your nose is wet. Please stop bumping me with it. Their voice box is broken. They just need a really big, like, cough drop. That's, that's the real ending of the game. You synthesize a giant cough drop and you give it to a scavenger and you become eternal friends. Parker, could you sit somewhere that is not directly in front of my monitor? Specifically the monitor I used to play the game, in fact. Alright, Parker. Money. So at some point, at basically this point, actually, we need to go to those, um, the clues. Life pot four. So it's right next to the Aurora, so this one should be pretty easy to find. Yeah, yeah, in a bit. That's what I'm talking about. Look at all that food. Vital signs stabilizing. Yes. Food, at least refilling my food, no longer a problem. Hell yeah. All right. Uh... 
Yeah, should be good. All right, let's just go say hi to the Aurora at this point. Eh. No, not the power cell. Uh, Altera is the company that they seem to just like own everything basically. I'm not sure if they're like a science corporation or if they just produce all of this stuff. They seem to be kind of like shitty Starfleet. Like really shitty capitalist Starfleet. You just kind of learn about them through its and bits through the game. I actually really like the 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 lower delivery vehicles in this. A lot of game, a lot of people. I've seen people like complain about it's not cool if it's just given in audio logs and stuff, and like disliking the concept of lore in games and stuff. I I prefer this honestly for the most part. Um, as far as distributing information about a game, like I'm a huge fan of how Metroid Prime, one, two, and three handle their lore and all that stuff. Wayland Yutani? I don't know. That must be like a rival corporation or something. Dang, she crashed on some pretty high ground. If you can call this ground, which I guess not exactly. This place almost looks like the sea uh, the the safe shallows again. Where the Dutani is the company from Aliens. Oh. I figured it was something that was in the game, but... There you go. <laughs> the lore is this is a crazy night at SeaWorld, yes. This is what SeaWorld looks like when you're just frickin' wasted. This is what Kirk saw. I don't like that. That's the color I saw when that big thing came to like eat my sea moth. I don't like that. I don't like that one bit. What the fuck is that? Oh, I think this is a scavenger holding or a stalker. Yes, yeah, just a stalker with the thing in his mouth. I think there's a couple good Aliens games. Um, they're pretty old, though. Um, which direction did the... Northwest of the Aurora's port midsection. This is port. Right. Yeah, that's the booty of the ship, so this is port. Pro tip on how to remember port versus starboard. Port is left and they both have the same amount of letters. That's how I remember it. Uh, you know what? Oh, just... It's supposed to be at sea level. I should be able to see this stupid thing. Yeah, Alien vs. Predator 2, I think, is the one I'm thinking of. There's a, there's an older one that was really good, but um, I have not played it myself, so I've been told it's good. I'm still close to the Aurora, so I don't want that thing to eat me again, or my Seamoth at least. Is that just sand sharks? Okay, good. I was about to say, is that sand sharks or something way bigger? Ah, oh, god damn it. 
I keep hitting myself in the booty with my own Seamoth. And my character is so dramatic about it. Alien's one of those, you know, really popular, oh, battery. Really popular franchise, ended up making a lot of Sci like games and stuff about it, but most of them not so good. But some of them were good. Um, full scan and fragment. Man. Already got that. All right, let's see if we can get inside this fucker. Um, I don't know if you're supposed to see this part from this close. Oh wow, I actually get on land. This guy found like the only piece of land on this freaking planet to land on. Huh. Alien blackout. Not sure I've heard of that one. Very vaguely familiar. Ooh, big titanium deposit. Oh, I'm swimming in batteries now. I like it. After after so much pain being caused to me because of the stupid batteries, I'm I'm totally I'm totally down with getting some new batteries from the Aurora. How do we get inside this bad boy though? It's so weird the quality of these textures compared to a lot of the rest of the stuff in the game. I mean, they have to be really big ass textures, but. Still kind of striking. What the hell is that? Cyclops engine! Oh! Cyclops is the, um, submarine. Oh, oh. Oh god, do you have to craft each piece individually? Oh shit. I've only found like a couple pieces, but. Not a salvage. Well, progress is progress. I'll allow it. I mean, I am playing on medium settings, but like, compare this texture quality to, you know, that. Like, obviously I'm supposed to be here, I'm supposed to be able to see this, but why is it, why is it like that? I suppose finding the inlet into a giant starship. Oh, I can't go. Oh. I can't, I can't go in there. The sole, like, tiny inlet into a giant starship is like a tiny little meat human would be fairly difficult. I miss my rebreather. But I would probably be, like, dead without it, so. Life form readings in this region are sparse. Um. The Aurora's radioactive fallout will have devastating effects on the alien ecosystem if not contained within the next 24 hours. Um. I don't think I'm going to be able to do anything in 24 hours, computer. Why is it vibrating? Why is it shaking? Graphics. What even is graphics? Is the ship exploded? The ship already exploded. I thought the amount of radioactivity was about what it would be, period. Why is it shaking? Why is it shaking? It already blew up. Does, is, can it, what? I don't like this.
spooky ambience is not helping game. <gasps> yes, the Cyclops engine pieces are though. Part of this game has FIFA graphics, and the other half is Temple Run graphics. <laughs> Water maximum level graphics. Ship? No. <laughs> just, just no. It's got some good funky music, though. I don't, I don't think I'm supposed to be on this. This is so weird, because they, obviously they knew you would be here. Alright, you know what? I need to go back to the Seamoth and bring it around. Why is it shaking? <gasps> okay, we got, we got the Cyclops engine, though. Oh shit, no we don't. I thought that was another piece of the Cyclops. Oh no it is! What the fuck is that? Did you see that shadow? I don't like that. I don't like whatever that was. Maybe we should just let the Aurora kill everything down here. That would be fine. I don't think anything around here needs to be alive. Honestly, so... I fully support if the Aurora is gonna kill everything in this area. I I support its decisions. I think it has, you know, the right to, 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 to do as it will. Alright. I should have taken the sea moth with me. I... Oh! Hi! How you doing? You having, you having fun? You having a good day? Bye! Thanks. Thanks for stopping by. Nice to meet you. I'm new in the neighborhood, you see. <laughs> Alright. Bye then. I'm sad I didn't get to scan it, but... I'm not going back. Yeah, that was the thing that ate my sea moth. I hope you're happy with yourself. I hope that gave you indigestion, asshole. That was expensive. Actually, not that expensive, but don't help tell him that. <laughs> you just kind of came to say hi. Where's the stupid life pod? I'm gonna die out here. Nobody told me that would be there. Actually, I expected that would be there, but still. Ooh, he's not having a good day. Is that from the Aurora? Don't tell me if if true. Again, no, we don't need spoilers. I'm just pondering. Funny to me how valuable whole fish. Better than a half fish. It came back just to mock me after eating my my sea moth. Oh boy. 
kind of feel like I should just go home. I got like three batteries out of this deal. Um, I'm definitely not going back to where that... <laughs> Maybe the graphics are bad over there just because they expect the, um... They expect the big bitey boy to like eat you if you go over and see the bad graphics. That's your punishment for seeing the unfinished parts of the game. And yeah, it's not necessarily unfinished because like the game is finished. This is... It's been in full release for like a year now actually. Which I actually didn't know until... Until Below Zero come, came out. I didn't know this game was finished, and like, I was... My general rule is I don't play unfinished games too much. So I was waiting for it to come out, but I never knew. I didn't know when it came out for, for like, for reals. Oh, here we go. Welcome aboard, Captain. Ship has long distance textures. Yeah, but like, level of detail is a thing. You'd think it would, like, load in better ones near here. Especially since you do, like, have to board it. Like, I'm not being a freaking weirdo and, like, getting too close to it or anything. Um, there's supposed to be a way to get in there. Not sure how, but... Yeah, I'll come out here with, like, nothing but the scanner equipped and scan him and probably die in the process. And I think that will still save. I think if you die, it still keeps what you've scanned. I don't like these big open expanses because that's where the bitey boy comes from. And I don't like that. I, uh. Seriously, where is this, this stupid life pod? Unless it sank. Is it possible it sank in the time that that, like, it took to get here or something? Oh, hey. We're here. Or, or, or another one of these kelp forests, or mushroom forests. We walk into the ship, 18 billion giant fish rain from the sky. It's really, it really just takes one. I actually wonder if we can kill that thing if we because we can we can get torpedoes you as like a person don't get weapons But you can get torpedoes for the uh, the ship Man the last one of these the first one of these I found it was loaded with lithium like everywhere There we go All right, I guess it's in the shale out croppings. That's what I'm looking for Oh, hey, what's that? <gasps> yes! Okay, so... Cyclops bridge. We have the bridge and the engine. How many more pieces could there possibly be? Ah, see, that's, that's what I was looking for. There's, there's sometimes there's just lithium out there in the open. is those that make that squeal. They're very good friends. I like these friends. Much better than the big toothy boy with the tusks and the ate my ship. You can go to hell. Oh, oh. I think I need to get the prawn suit. Mario, take your frog suit! I think we need the prawn suit to, to access those, which I... I found many prawn suit arms. But not a prawn suit itself. That was Tolds. Yeah, we already have that. I was... What the fuck is... Oh! Oh, that's it! That's it! Finally! Wow. Yeah, where's Bikini Bottom at? I want to scan Squidward. Assessment, stay away. Hey, Peeper. Peeper, no peeping. All right. Well, 
looking for accidentally. Um, there it is. <laughs> Look at that texture repeat. Good enough. What the hell? Hold up. What are you bitching at me for, phone? the Cyclops now then because I've only seen bridge and engine fragments I haven't seen like hull fragments or anything so I'm not sure they're needed all right this is like the only one that oh I'm not sure that's how buoyancy works unless it's breached oh it's breached of course Nobody else is alive. I'm, I'm getting that. Creature decoy. Interesting. Wait, no. 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 Oh. I wanted to read the PDA. Shit. Okay. Let me just clear my notifications, I guess. Repulsion. Wait, what's the difference between repulsion and propulsion? Enhances propulsion. The cost of the ability to draw. Just let's see. Also, like, it's only a force away style one. Got it. Photographic evidence for later retrieval. It's such a small number of items. Alright, I don't need any equipment ones. Not blueprints. Aurora survivors. I bought four crew log. So any Altair crew crew. Landed in area of significant alien activity. Encountered predators in the Leviathan class, highly aggressive. Spectroscope scanner assigned species designator, Reaper. One specimen attempted to swallow the life pod, doing extensive damage in the process. Only viable option is to make for the safety of the Aurora crash site. I have retrieved a data box with the creature decoy and enough resources to fabricate a couple of them. The swim's longer than the decoy lifetime, but it should just be enough to keep them busy. If you don't find me on board the ship, I presume I miscalculated. Alright, buddy. So I'm guessing that thing that we found is called is the Reaper. Yes, Mr. Shepard, the Reapers. somewhere in here though oops no not that way what was that oh just a tiny boy just a tiny boy nothing to worry about reaper leviathan I think leviathan is the class of creature though I think it's just the live the, the Reaper. Uh, whoa. Hey, I think we're inside. Eh, kind of. Repair tool. Good. Uh. Warning: ship structural integrity is low. Fire suppression equipment and laser cutters may be required. Exploration is conducted at your own risk. Uh. Crap. I, I didn't bring a fire extinguisher, guys. Um, I also can't find out how to open this goddamn thing. 
I should have brought a beacon. I should have brought a beacon so I can shove it in whatever doorway you can actually get in here from. I just wanted to take a real quick peek, Reno, inside. Something up here. Let me just. No. Like I said, finding the one little tiny human sized entry point in a ship this big. Easy said than done. All of the yellow markings, maybe? There aren't really enough of those to do that. Mm. I'm gonna repair this fucker real quick. Oh right, I have plenty of spare batteries, what am I doing? Walkway above the water. Uh, what am I doing? Welcome aboard, Captain. It doesn't really seem like it. I feel, kind of feel like this would be the sort of situation we have to go down in order to go up. Feels like this must be the way to get in, though. It's all like blown open. Get in from the surface? It's like here? It's not on this side. There's some land over here so I won't get eaten by a leviathan. Probably. Alright! What's that? Oh, salt. Y'all got any of that ingress? Well, there's birds. Birds, take me to freedom. Fly me away. Birds, please. Bird. Bird, take me to your sky fortress. Teach me the ways of your people. Raise me to become frickin' Samus Aaron. I'm ready. I'm ready! They don't care. I don't think the solution is to Skyrim it up. No, it's not. Um, did you 
eat that bird IRL. If I was like starving, maybe. If it was cooked up real nice. I don't think this is actually where you get in. I don't know how the hell you do get in this stupid thing. That, that place up front really felt like the best way to get in. It was like completely torn open, so there should be a way in, right? Whereas this other crap just really doesn't seem like it. Hints. Look at that. I hope it's not serious about that 24 hours thing. Or if it is, it means like 24 real hours. Not like 24 in-game hours. Because 24 in-game hours is like 5 minutes! In fact, it's probably already been 24 in-game hours, so I don't think it means that. I thought there was a creature, but it was just the rock wall. a hint. That's where I just was. Oh good, there's bone. Oh. Never mind, that's just one of these things like really close. I thought that was like one of those bone sharks. I'm gonna stay real goddamn close. Close to the back entrance. It can't be the- it can't be the back entrance. Hi! No, no. No, 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 no. There's no need for that. No, no, no. No, there's no Superman here. I don't think we need to be here anymore, honestly. My inventory is full. I'm gonna take one peek and see if I can find a thing, but... I'm kind of tired of bumping into those now. Yeah, that was a reaper, yes. Maybe it's more down? If I were the entrance to a starship, where would I be? Ooh! No? No. I hope if this water weren't so goddamn, like, mysteriously orange. It's like a fantasy. No pun intended. What's this? Nothing. Nothing at all. Ah! Sorry, buddy. Oops. No, 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 no. Decide you would become a gamer. If, if you mean what game I first played, um, my parents got me a uh, Super Nintendo pretty late in the gen, but I got a. Uh, hell, I was a kid, I didn't know. Um, but it came with Donkey Kong Country 1 
and Yoshi's Island. I pretty much just played the hell out of those. Is that a scannable thing? No, it's just jump. I, I think I give up on this for right now, because I can't... Even if I find the way in, I can't really do anything right now. My inventory is full. I can't even tell where I am. Alright, I think this is where I came from. Another hint. Doesn't... Do I access it from like on the sides? So I don't access it from over here, or what's the deal? I'm gonna go drop off my loot anyway. Um, because even if I could get in, I don't have the f fire extinguisher and I don't have any space in my inventory. Big crack. What big crack? This? This is where I just was. Uh, but this is like where I just was. Doesn't matter. I have to go back to the base for now. I find the walkway up there. Huh. Yeah, I'll get a, f a full fire extinguisher. Um, I should have plenty of batteries. Everything else I pretty much have except for prawn if I need it. I don't assume I need it. Yeah, we're trying to get in the ship, though. I, I My inventory is full of valuable stuff, and I don't want to get eaten by a leviathan right now. Which almost happened twice. We just kind of, like, noped right out. We just kind of ignored... Actually, we just kind of ignored it the second time. It was just like... And I was just like, eh, I'd rather not. Hey, friend. How are you doing? chill at home for a little bit here. I found like a lot of copper. This is the most copper I've ever had. I'm really excited about that. I can finally build some of the stuff that I've not been building just because it requires copper and I didn't want to use copper. You see, I knew it would be the front of the ship. It was all torn up. Here's home. <laughs> I feel so much less, in, even less intimidated by scavengers and like even bone sharks now. They can't do anything to me. That thing, <laughs> that thing could do things to me. What if I can build torpedoes yet? What was it that I needed for torpedoes? Dock this so it charges up. I was worried that it would run out of charge, but the CMOS battery is actually pretty dang legit. Like the name. Wait, I can. Oh, I can name it. Excellent. 
Where does his name go? Sea boy! Perfect. Beautiful. I, I didn't even mean to do that. I didn't know. I didn't realize that was there. I was looking for the upgrade station. Um, what is this? Common modules. Storage module. <gasps> A storage module in the sea. Oh, that is nice. Engine efficiency. Hull reinforcement. I don't think I have the diamonds to spare just for that. Torpedo. Aerogel. I can make that. I can make that. Right, but first need to eat. I would build, oh, I love the little one tube. I would build under that, but the game generally will not let me. There's some weirdness about this particular region. Uh, Emergency, starvation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Calorie intake immediately. Uh, conductive, put all this in here. Obviously, storage comes before, you know, not dying of starvation. Titanium. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, I'm gonna have a hundred lockers just for titanium. Let me just cram that. Got a lot of first aid kits. I'll probably need some. Let's eat some food. Oh, I love these trees. These trees are amazing. Vital signs stabilizing. You can just get so much food. They're not like take with you food, but whatever. That doesn't. That's not as big a deal. I'll cure some fish for that at some point. How many empty batteries? The same will show your surroundings. Oh, yeah. Um, I don't know where my fire extinguisher went, but I think I could just make it. Can't I? Yes? No? Purple tablet. Huh. Oh, three titanium. Decided to make my loco a tap tap because I like them because they're cool. They're just really chill and nothing really stops them for the most part. And they're just always so damn happy, so that's pretty much why. I want that small storage locker. Let's reach out to any of them. I'm so low on lithium now, though. That first mushroom forest I found, I had so much, but every time I've been to one since, I can't find any. Where's this, like, storage? Oh. Not bad. Got some first aid kits in there. Titan. I don't know what else I would even need that for. Lithium 
Aerogel. Three titanium. I think I got that. One, two, three. If you live in my base, you better like the sound of the reef backs. Gas pods. I hope that Leviathan thing is susceptible to uh, gas torpedoes. Uh, aerogel, aerogel, gel sac. Oh, I forgot to bring gel sacs. I have exactly enough, but. Gel sacks. Where do we even find those? Those were... Gel sacks were in the mushroom forest, right? I think. Uh, Seamoth torpedo system. And... Okay. Alright, gotta bring a bunch of... Uh... enough to kill one of those goddamn leviathan things. Alright. Uh, do I have to equip this? Yes, I do. Do I... How do I load the torpedoes? Is it like a thing? was a vortex one. I didn't load that though. How do I tell my ammo and stuff? Ah, here we go. Let's load her up. Stick these in the storage. Fancy. Bring some more water, though. Passing 100 meters, oxygen efficiency increased. Gear, uh, do I need that? Uh, water. Oh. Ugh, I need to get some table or. Er, Get some, uh, make some bleach for some disinfected water. This will do for now, and I probably have, yep, some of this again. There we go. need a waypoint, I can just look at the surface. Aurora is... Gotta be this way. Yep! There we go. Alright. 
Hey, big world. <laughs> Did PokeCord ever start working again on the server? Uh, they're, they're probably updating it or something. I, I, I doubt it's something specific to our server. I'm just not sure we know anybody else that's in another server with it. My own site had issues today, too, actually. Um, almost certainly not related, but... Uh, Linode's, uh, the serve... Whoa! Bleh. It's really weird just you go through it, going through the surface of the water. When they're, like, just stuck at that level. Oh, no. No, no, no. Such a big sand explosion for being such little things. Yeah, we haven't had any Pokemon pop up today at all. Like, as in the last almost 24 hours at this point. So, something's gotta be wrong. Need a little trench there. I was really tempted to blast that sand shark, but um, yeah, well, I think I'll save that for sorry for the uh, big boy. If I even have enough to kill it, because we have kind of limited amounts of stuff I can load in. I don't even know if the amount of stuff I have to shoot at it will kill. Alright, so in here... Oh wait, here? How did I not see this before? I, I've dicked around every square inch of this stupid thing. <gasps> Ow, what the... What the fuck was that? Oh, oh, fuck. How did you, you, you fake ass Metroid motherfucker, get, get, when did they get here? No, fuck. I did not see those things at all. You frickin' land Metroid punk. Get, spice you up, there you go. Already gonna guess the crew is dead because of those. So that's cool. Uh, don't tell me I was supposed to bring a propulsion cannon to knock this out of the way or something. Infinite jump. You gotta be kidding me. I do have to get a propulsion. Oh, god damn it. That's annoying. Oh. I'm just gonna kill all of these while I'm here. Hey, asshole. Why are they all alive? Oh. I suppose there's like a replicator I could use up here or something. Oh, there's so many. How did they even get here? Caution. Scans show the digestive tracts of nearby life forms contain human tissues. Hooray! Told you. Oh, ow. I wasn't even near it. Let's be real. Well, that one just went into the ravine. Oh, 
Oh, what? I was nowhere near the fire. Okay, I don't. Putting out like a forest fire with like a drop of water. See, that's a safe, reasonable thing to do. <sighs> God damn it. Well, if, if there's anything else. I must have added that. LPs I've seen didn't need it. Well, I mean, there's shit in the way. If there's anything else I need, let me know before <laughs> before I get stuck again, please, because I don't want to make this trip a fourth time. Ugh. I really hope that 24 hours timer genuinely means 24 hours of real time. Because we've already wasted like one or two at this point. I probably just one. Just one since the message, anyway. Trying to go through the aurora. By the way, what is the deal with this planet? Moon? What, what is the size of this supposed to be? Is that like, it just, it seems way too close and moving way too fast. Like, I'm, I'm just wondering if there's been like, somebody's tried to math out whether it's possible for that to be there and not like, I have the two land masses just collide. It, it just seems like too big of a gravity well to be that close. Seymour, the ship is on fire. No, mother, it's just the northern lights. Wait. I'm going home. Alright. The life pod is really close to my home thing anyway. It used to be more realistic. Like creatures and stuff. I think the current vibe is like pretty perfect. <sighs> Back and forth. Oh, the size of the moon. It is like like that 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 moon has to be nearly the size of this planet. I, I don't... <laughs> that just doesn't seem very feasible to me. But I guess that is kind of like a thing a lot of artists do to make something feel more alien, right? Is to make planets unreasonably close together and stuff. How much fuel? <laughs> I gotta make another one of these. I wasted like half the fuel on nothing. I think it was three fuel. Or three titanium. Whatever. All right, so what do I need to make a propulsion cannon? I've never even done that. Stasis rifle. Guys, I can't make a propulsion cannon. Oh, son of a bitch. Do you think a grav trap? Oh, no, I'm not gonna risk it. Ah. Uh, fuck. Well, where do I get a, where do I get a, a uh, propulsion thing. What do the Martian moons look like on Mars? This is actually a really cool documentary you can see about that. It's called Doom for DOS programs. Real. Stress signals and receive life pod six. If you request assistance, navigation. Sunk approximately a meter. Get an area dense with red grass near a number of natural arches and rock stacks. West northwest. I need to make a compass at some point. Where do I even make the compass thing from? I should probably make that at this point.
I've already seen the Reaper. I know I I don't know why you want me to see the Reaper like that. Modification system. Uh prawn suit grappling arm. Scanner. Psychops bridge. Ah. So I do need more for the Cyclops. I thought we found enough engine pieces, so oh, whatever. Uh, Spot line, float line, exterior, grow bed. Seen all these, know that. Uh, power cell charge. Plant shelf. make a compass oh here we go wait where is equipment copper wire wiring kit got it easy enough copper wire Jeez. I don't know why I didn't see that. Alright, how do I use the compass? Oh. I was just... Oh. Got it. Okay, so we are just going to go find that other life pod since we have the compass and we can find it pretty easy now. All systems online. Come on now. Not there. There she is. So what's the hint again? Life pod four we found. West northwest of life pod four. All right. I could have swore I'd unlock the uh, propulsion cannon. I guess I just got two out of three. So if I find one more fragment, I'll be good. I hope I haven't passed up any propulsion cannon pieces thinking I had it. In fact, I'll need to like... Ooh, 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 ooh. I need these, like, a lot. I've, I've only got one of those. In fact, I might have lost it. I don't even know if I still have the one I had. Uh, leave the Seamoth alone, please. I, like, never see those. Timed or not, I figured it wouldn't be super strict. Like, I figured... I don't think there's anything, like, super stressful time-wise in this game. Despite being a survival game. But, um... I would just like to explore the stupid Aurora at this point. I should be pretty much ready, other than... The propulsion cannon. Unless I need a sub, which I don't believe I do. And... Ow. I've heard there's stuff in there that is, like, good. So there's stuff that's good. Just in case. No? Nah, it's a sea glide. Nah, I think, I think stuff around here would just be, like, sea glides and stuff. Basic bitch stuff. What if I could just use a grav trap instead? I've never used a grav trap. Even I'm not particularly sure the point of them, honestly. That's 
fancy beacon. Steve King says he'll re seek re-election. That's not a surprise. Steve King has always been insanely racist. No, he, his voters don't care. His voters like that. It's the opposite of the for problem for him, unfortunately. I'm really glad that the Sea Glide maintains its, like, altitude. Or whatever you call altitude while underwater. Grab to just pull small things towards it. Mm. Should, like, toss it in a place with, like, lots of items you want to get, I guess? Oh, let's you collect. Oh, for, like, prey fish. Got it. There's a wreck around here. I don't know if it would have. Propulsion. Man, now where, where did I find the propulsion can and stuff? I'm equipped to explore pretty much any of these large wrecks now. So I can cut in. Got anything tasty in here? No? I think it's just a bioreactor. Yeah. Oh, hi. I'm not sure I've ever actually been hit by one of those land sharks or sea sand sharks, whatever they are. No, it's just a laser cutter. <laughs> He's like, what'd you say about me, punk? What'd you say about not being hit by me? Oh, another wreck. Wait, is this the one I just ex I explored? Did I go? I think it is. Yeah, it is. Oh, wow. Then I was, like, right here near the thing. Or maybe, wait. I don't know which way this... Ugh. Uh... I should have just left a beacon on it. It was like kind of in the mushroom forest area, right? It was somewhere here around. I think it'd be easier to see. It's like the only thing on the surface of this planet, but... I don't think it actually is, like, loaded in. Uh... Whoa. Hi, friends. Hi, friend. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Oh, here it is. Oh, it's like super close to the Aurora. There we go. Jeez. 
be very familiar with this area by the time we're done here. Alright, so... From the overturned lifeboat... Four hundred meters west northwest. West northwest. About a hundred meters down. I have no idea what distance I'm at. Is that a scannable? <gasps> yes. Oh yes. We get in there. We get in there on the Cyclops. Ooh, copper ore fragment. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Oof. Um. Ooh. Oh, I already got that. In fact, I think I, th I, think I saw that very piece before. It'll be good to get some lithium and stuff while we're here anyway. I know how I'll measure distance. I think with your head tap tap. Oh, oh, jackpot! Holy crap, look at this. This cliff face is awesome. Propulsion cannon, please. <gasps> yes! Everything's coming up. Tap, tap. There we go. Acquired. Acquired. It's probably around here somewhere. But what I'll do... I'll put a beacon... Oh, God. <laughs> I'll just drop the titanium when I need to. beacon because I can't determine distance what I'll do <laughs> put a little beacon there life bot 4 is there Back to the sea boy. So much titanium. Passing one hundred meters. Yeah, yeah. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Welcome aboard, Captain. All right. So I am currently west northwest of the thing. 300 meters. West. west, northwest. It's probably down here then.
Sorry, Titanium. I don't need you. Well, I do, but I can kind of find you anywhere. No offense. Fun fact about zebras. Zebras are black with white stripes. Not white with black stripes. That's your useless fact of the day. A little bit further here. Ah, perfect! <laughs> I knew the beacon trick would work. All right, what you got for me, buddy? What are you doing? You were gone so long. I thought you drowned. Put the flare down. I was going to try and attract someone's attention. That's not a distress flare. Stop waving it around like that. You'll catch the fuel line. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> In it, fucking in incredible. Even in the future, people are fucking dumbasses. Integrating new PDA data. Ma'am, I need you to stay calm. We're not in immediate danger. Where are the rescue teams? The Aurora didn't make it. So, where are the rescue teams? They're dead, ma'am. We have rendezvous coordinates, but the routes are radiated. So, what are you going to do? I'm head of human resources, ma'am. This is not my expertise. <laughs> but the PDA says if You're we doomed. can find some lead, we can make radiation suits. Oh, there! I am not setting foot outside this life pod without the proper protection. Don't worry. I'll go. Should have had her go. Aren't you guys are lucky you landed near all kinds of lead. Ooh, silver. Gotta have that. Oh, shit. Silver? Silver the Hedgehog, where'd you go? Here we go. I just realized these, these poor whale dudes, the poor reefbacks, Getting their annual dose of radiation every 24 hours here. Actually, probably a lot more than that. I guess it depends on how nuts so the. Oh no, we already checked this out. Oh man, I was right here. Alright, so I think we've checked basically everything we can. Um, just kind of. We need to check out the Aurora at this point. Ooh, what's that? Seamoth. So close, but so far from the uh, Cyclops. Are they <gasps> Reginald! Shit, where'd he go? Reginalds are supposed to be great for. Uh, I forget if it's food or the bioreactor. But if I can make an alien containment and fill it with those dudes, it'll be good. I love this new oxygen tank. It's so it's so it's so much better. It's so much better I can't even process how to express how much better it is. I'll crack this open. Passing one hundred meters. Oxygen this guy must be swole if he just like breaks limestone. Just like it was a bear. Why is this? What do you. He just breaks limestone with his bare ass hands. The Second Amendment of the United States protects the right to bare ass hands. And it's gone. It's. It's, <laughs> it's lost into the abyss. It's, it's just, oh, oop. There we go. I like to think it's 
to suit. Thirty seconds. Maybe, but I mean, that's still there's still that would still require the same amount of muscle strength. It's just the suit would oops. Hopefully, provide you some like not busting your flesh apart protection. So much gold. I can make like a golden idol while I'm out here. Become Isaac from Binding of Isaac. Ah, oh, you can't do a backflip. I was kind of, I was hoping to do a flip. I guess that would have been a front flip, but whatever. A flip of any sort. Yeah, I'm heading back. I just need to be able to make the propulsion cannon, and I was hoping more Oculus parts or Oculus, um, bum bum bum. What's uh, Cyclops parts? Something to do with the eyes. Oculus is one of the fish. I don't know if we've seen an Oculus in the stream. I found them in the the little geothermal hole that's near my base now. Can I fit through this? Kind of. Oh yeah, we can go down here now! I'll show you the Oculus. They're way down in here. Oh, there's crab snakes in here, too. They look a lot like the peepers. Oh, yeah, there, there were some of these things down here, too. I scanned them. And there's, like, gold deposits, but I can't extract those right now. Oh, also... I heard you can find those crab snakes' eggs inside these things. I didn't even think you could go inside them. But you can. There it is! But I don't really have any inventory space. They're like right outside my base so I can find them anytime. I'm not seeing any of the Oculus. Oculi, though. Oh, th there they are! Yeah, there's these purple boys. They're like peepers, but purples. Oop. By the way, stalactites don't form in underwater caves. So, ow. Which most of the caves in the game do not have, so that would actually imply that this area here used to be, uh, used to have air. And used to not be underwater. Um, I'm kind of lost. go come on it's such a shame this thing doesn't fix it for you but I guess the repair tool isn't that expensive uh, there we go all right so what do we need uh, no I won't cook Reginald I'll put him in here. Uh, conductive. Oh. Gold isn't there. Lead is not conductive. Uh, wow. First time I've had the conductive chest full. Man, that 
freaking fire extinguisher goes down real fast. I'll have to be careful with it. Um, I'll take some foods and some drinks. do I make the propulsion cannon? Battery wiring kit titanium. Not not nearly as bad as I was fearing. That's actually ridiculously cheap considering it's a basically a gravity gun. Oh, what's this? Creature decoy. Tracks creatures to the location. Hmm. Copy your claim once deployed. Hmm. I'm not 100% sure why I would need that. Maybe to, like, distract and, like, sneak attack on the Reaper, but... Seaboy <laughs> docked! I like that. What other colors can we change on here? Stripe. Stripe one? Where's the stripe? And black works. Alright, fully charged. I think we have, thanks to the bioreactor, honestly, we didn't really need the bioreactor to charge. We just needed it to have that much extra energy to have, like, for backup power. Because, like, it slowly drains power when it's nighttime. Because I'm mostly powered by the, uh, I think, Renos. The solar pa panels. I think at some point I'll be able to... Yeah, yeah. I think at some point I'll be able to use geothermal stuff. I want that Oculus, but that'll... We'll do that later. We gotta fix the Aurora. May it hopefully not kill us all. So who else is completely beyond sick of winter? We have had an ice storm or at least sleet or worse every week for the last four weeks. It's been appalling. I, I, the, the, the February has been worse of a winter than most of the, you know, December and January, it's been blah. <laughs> oh yeah, you can see, you can see the little thing that pops up when I plug in my phone, can't you? Because I'm capturing the full, I'm capturing with my capture card instead of the game directly. What I really need to do is set up the, uh, I need to set up my backup PC to do the streaming and so then I can dedicate 100% of the resources for my main PC to playing the game, but I'm lazy. It's really inconsistent. Ice storm in the week fall by 40 degrees. That's pretty much what we've been having. It melts just enough to like leak through my like shitty, the holes in like my roof and stuff. All right. How did I miss this? This is like, the most obvious thing, I don't understand. I must have gone in a different way. Like, I think I went in through directly through the front. Huh? 
It looks so dorky. It's it's like the dorkiest. No, I don't want to throw it. Just like drop it. Wait, I have that right. Yeah. Eh. Might as well finish this one out first. Good, there's still underwater bar. Of course there'd be underwater parts still. Another battery. Lots of batteries down here. The um, the AI didn't like have a snarky remark about like eye damage from the uh, from the laser cutter. Oh hey, hold up! Oh, don't touch that. Don't breathe this. Um, there was a code. for something that we got probably can't get into all these quite yet but there was a captain's quarters two six seven nine two six seven nine no I don't actually know which one of these will be the one that needs that but I'll just scan all of them or er, Friend. Lab access. New PDA data. 6483. 6483. 6483. That shit. 6. 6483. There we go. Data bank corruption was detected on your PDA. Your technology blueprints have been updated. Huh. So, what else we got in here? See this arm thing? Oh, that's not a thing. Okay. Large sample flask, huh? For things? Huh. Microscope non functional. Are, are these just for like a sticking in your thing? What can we learn from behind my booster feet? Ah, oh, shit. I want to read that, but I don't want to drown. So. like a fine place to do some light reading. What can we learn from the hive mind? What can we learn about totally not the Borg? Find organisms by their traits, blah blah blah. Cons of a tab pulls me in.
It's really a hive mind if they're doing like op opposing things with each other. Moo! You pose an interesting point, Parker. Moo, indeed. Moo! Hi, yes. Meh, indeed. All right, you're not. Get, 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 get down, please. Moo. By the way, anybody else who like has a YouTube channel, have you been getting lots of first comment spam lately? Cause I hadn't really been, I mean, that's always been a degree of a thing, but like I ban people for it. So like, I don't usually get tons of it, but suddenly I've been getting a lot of people posting just one. And I, I think it must be the same dude each time. Because it's always just one. Well, not always, but it's annoying. And if you if you are just learning this now, don't don't do first comments. I I always delete them, and sometimes I ban the person who's posting them because they're just they're they're spam. That's that's they're spam or trolling at best. It's just. Ugh. Was safely buried in the shrine of truce. This is very like fancy talk garbage. Okay, that was, that was a lot of... See you, Big Weld. Thanks for stopping in. That was a lot of fancy talk for very little. And I'll be streaming more Subnautica, so don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more stuff. I'll probably stream the whole game at this point. Hello. Uh, sealed door cut. Oh, we've already done this. Wasn't there another? Oh, that was just the same door. Got it. I didn't bring a lot of stuff. I didn't really expect this would be an inside. Whoa, hi. Burning ceiling. That's fine. I didn't really prepare for an underwater adventure. Aurora black box data. Slingshot maneuver. Heavily standard here. Pulse detector. Pack detected. Manual piloting. Eight life pods. Why is there only one person not accounted for? Non-essential systems maintenance chief Riley Robinson. Was it a sabotage setup? High priority terminal. High priority terminal in captain's quarters. That's what we have access to. Monitoring equipment failed. T plus eight out to thirteen hours. All right, so we need to get to the captain's terminal, as we always do in these situations. Moist, but also on fire. Like, look at this. It's sp spicy, but it should not be spicy. I should probably get a flashlight out. But we can move with the thing up, which is a neat touch, because sometimes that's relevant. There we go. Tubes. No, no Jeffrey's tube for us, huh? We got a big old pipe maze. Ooh! Oh, it's just a flashlight. I thought it would be something all fancy, but no, the game's just like, hey, you should, if you didn't bring a flashlight, you're stupid, but you can have, you can have ours.
Oh, those aren't. Never mind. I thought there was like part of a Cyclops thing or something. But why would that be inside here? It's more of these magical papers. Ooh, fire extinguisher. That's what we came for, boys. Uh, we need four. I think that's what that weird leg thing we found was before, maybe. All right, halfway there. I like the dramatic and dynamic music of the whoa. The frame drop zone. The prawn suits are like only in here, so there's probably more to find. I don't really understand the underwater electricity stuff that's like extremely localized and very safe. Good news. Three out of four! Oh, they're big. <gasps> there it is. Oh, jeez. This, this is a spicy room. Yeah. I'm out. Let me scan it! Maybe I can scan it better from up here, I guess. Is this a cuttable door? No. Time to start looking at prawn, yes. Time for some dank prawn. Um, huh? Yes. Nutrient blocks. Oh shit. Holy fuck! What? Useless glass container. I guess these are purely cosmetic things. Filtered water. Yeah, these are like dumb cosmetics. I'll, I'll leave them. I'll just leave them all here. I'll want them eventually, just, for, just to say that I have them, but... Ugh, I don't like that light. Too bright. Get out of here. I'm surprised you can just make a vending machine without being here. Ooh. Single wall shelf. I don't get Poke Core because we have reports it's working on other servers. Huh. Oh, fr Fanger. Well, they tried. Today's menu Space Bear Voulette! Volute, however you say that. Since their introduction to the interstellar vacuum, microspelic tardigrades or space bear. Oh my god! They're tardigrade. I thought space bear like a bear, but like in space. But they mean, they mean tardigrades. Wow. Hold on. Let me show you. If you don't know what a tardigrade is. <laughs> me. Me. <laughs> I get why they're called space bears, but still. 
Um, oh no, it's a WebP. Um, they're little extremophiles that um, theoretically could live in space. Um, or at least not die in space. They would still need to eat things, but beauteous, aren't they? Hello, Parker. I thought, I thought, when I thought space bear, this is not what I thought. You're gonna need a lot of these, by the way. These are microscopic, if that wasn't clear. You're gonna need a lot of those. Since their introduction to the interstellar vacuum, microscopic tardigrades have adapted to forests where no other life forms is fine. Condense into a smooth, nutty, protein-rich soup. They are the freshest local ingredient available to travelers on long-haul space flights. Cottage pie or nutrient block. Rehydrated minced beef in its own gravy. Served with a topping of minced Chinese potato. Fre fresh picked this morning from onboard grow beds. A side of sautéed Chinese potato plant leaves. For the tiny conscious consumer, the usual nutrient block options are available. Maybe consumed cold or reconstituted at the on-site fabricator. Oh, we can reconstitute the nutrient block? Delicious. You think they could just have like ramen? Because you you just add water, but whatever. Nutrient block. Can I get a nutrient block flavored ramen, please? Thanks. Dessert: dried fruits and nuts. For unfortunately, a recent accident at Cargo Bay Three involving the incorrect application of a repulsion cannon, in combination with a modified battery charger, resulted in the venting into space of all dehydrated desserts. Fruit and nuts will be the only available dessert for the next 39 weeks. Thanks, Riker. What? 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 How are these people? How do these people make it into space? These people are too stupid to live. Parker, would you calm down? I swear to you, these people do not. I'm taking this poster though. Please don't be big. Oh good, it's small. At least there's fire extinguishers set. Uh, ah, Parker. <sighs> oh, it's out. Well. We don't need you. <gasps> Snap blue! Oh shit. Garlic bread, mac and cheese, ham and cheese. Frontiersman discount available. Welcome, check our specials. BBQ sliced beef. Trish. This is me, this is where I belong. Wait, fake beans? No, it's baked beans, not fake beans. <laughs> I guess I can just leave this room on fire. For the most part. Ah, eh, whatever. I want the trash. Oh, hey, there's stuff in here to help you kind of like not die. That's nice of them. Nutrient block. I want a nice spicy nutrient block. I love the disgusting glub noise. What? This is massive space chest and all that's inside is a single nutrient block. Why? Oh, fake brands. I thought you said fake beans. Which, ow. Is also potentially relevant. Why does the menu on the wall sound so much better than the one in the lore dump? Wait, can I scan? Oh, bed! I need a freaking bed! I haven't, I have not, like, laid down 
in like four weeks in game. Holy shit. Rising above the competition, Prawn Suit Mark Three. The what? The pressure reactive, waterproof nano suit is a range of mechs designed to protect the pilot from extreme environments. The Mark III is the latest alternative. Thanks. Thanks, science brand, space brand. Carry all. Hell yeah. I'm just gonna like shove all of this stuff. Oh, you can stick things in the carry all. Sweet. That exact same locker from before. What a coincidence. I'm just gonna shove these in like the front of this place and like I can pick up all the cosmetics, all the dumb pointless cosmetic meh medics here later. Because things don't seem to ever despawn. Cause like Oh, um, that stupid thing, that, that seed cluster that we left here like 18 billion years ago still hasn't despawned, so, yeah. 2679. Nope. You can't get the trash! Are you ready to eat some garbage? Hey, Luigi. Um, bum bum bum. Two. What was the thing again? Two six. Seven. Hey, captains. Oh, it says it on the wall. Okay, go in here. Moment of truth. Ooh, fancy boy double bed. I can't scan it though. I want like lockers like this. Come on, man. Why can't I have any of his stuff? Integrating new PDA data. Neptune escape rocket. Hopefully it won't be like shot down. New blueprint acquired. No, but where's the limestone? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Outer layers of oxidized, which has been heated to over 12,200 1, Celsius. Ouch. That's about what would happen. Silage and type portions. Limestone. Oh, hey. Average long range transmission delay, eight hours. Opening last to recorded transmissions. This is an emergency distress call. Aurora is on collision course with planet 4546B. Sending all available environmental data. Please respond with rescue solution out. This is Altera HQ. Attached to this message, you should find the blueprints for an escape ship that we calculate will be capable of breaking orbit and getting you back to the nearest phase gate. Now, it's designed to use materials you can find and sit you, but it's gonna need one hell of a power source. Now, we'll be sure that... Aurora Long Range Communications Relay Offline. Yeah, it's just food. It's, can we make that? Is that added to our blueprint? Prawn suit. Neptune launch platform! Hell yeah! Titanium ingot lead computer chip. That's pretty basic, but I'm sure it requires a lot more than that. That's just like the launch platform. Pulsion can. We already made that game. We'll definitely be taking the Aurora poster, though. When did Scotty become the captain? He's also the same guy as the Degassi's, <laughs> the Degassi crew's like thing. Hey Grayson. Loading program, Craig McGillson of, what? 
one player. Captain Hot Dog Hollis here. Map Boreal 9. Resource Nom. What the? Oh, yeah, a quiet alien backwater when the ship you ride in implodes. Must be the Ar Arachnid Kidney Poacher. <laughs> Arachnid Kidney Poachers. He's, he's playing a text-based game. That's adorable. Farm alien plants. This is what Craig McGill would do. This is, this is adorable. That's just what Craig McGill would do. After foraging for some hours, you've collected a number of potentially farmable foodstuffs. Which will you sustain yourself with? Select Starwell eggs, please. Starwell eggs are nutritious. The life cycle of these vast, spacefaring creatures is much too slow to sustain a farm. Besides, their mother is extremely angry with you. Accept your fate. <laughs> <laughs> this guy sucks! Craig McGill knows there's no reasoning with the mother scorned. You were not so much torn apart as swallowed whole and disintegrated. The atoms you thought were you eventually gradually redistributed in service of the Star Wars. Continue survival. Would you like to continue? No. <laughs> this guy fucking sucks. Wow. Good job, Captain Moron. I, c I can't steal his bed, though. He has, like, fancy double bed. I want fancy double bed. How do we get into this? It's probably like a lore thing somewhere. Just toss this with the other crap. I'm glad they give you a little bit of food and water in here, and it makes sense that, like, you know, a, like, colony ship or whatever the hell this is, ow, would have, um, a little something-something in it for you to eat. Ooh, batteries. Like batteries. Delicious. Charity is an archaic concept. <laughs> Charity is an archaic concept, which the realism of today's Alterans has rendered obsolete. We understand that we are each responsible for ourselves with the best way to get the most for ourselves to work with each other with all terror. <laughs> <laughs> the implication of reasoning is clear. If someone is in need, they must be they must find a way to be needed. <laughs> they really are shitty capitalist starfleets. It's amazing. Altera Alms is a training facility of many We're not a charity, but we don't ask for Handa. Everything is also philanthropic benevolence, facilitation service, promoting synergy between employer and workforce. I'm, I'm so fucking done. Hey, it depend operates on a lottery system. By investing any large, any number of credits, you'd be entered into a prize draw. Larger investments will yield higher chances of winning. Credits will go to training unskilled colonists in vital tasks. Uh, colonists receive this training voluntarily for your charge. Condition of minimum contract with one of our investors in completion of the training. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, I should probably eat some med kits here. There we go. Oh, hey, water. Man, I want their lockers. Their lockers are way cooler than my lockers. Well, except you can't name their lockers. But other than that. There's a lot of carry alls, huh? Lots of batteries, too. I'm so... I'm gonna be set for batteries for life, which I am totally okay with. All the carry alls are empty. This is huge box is on somebody's bed for some reason. It just has a single nu nutrient brick. Delicious nutrient brand nutrient brick. Listen, I know I don't have the right to make demands of you, but I need you to understand that I want to change our arrangement. I hear what you're saying, and I will try to respect it. How would you like to change it? I would like to reduce our contact hours. How much further can we do that? To zero. You're dumping me. I'm changing the terms of our relationship. Oh my How god. Is this a relationship if we don't see each other? It's a relationship of a kind. You're setting the expectations. 
I feel you just want to spend more time with that dumb guy in his dumb robot suit. That's not a feeling. Totally. It's a judgment. And I feel hostility in what you're saying. Perhaps your jealousy is a sign that you need to take another look at your business model. Why can't you just I fucking hate these people. Me? I am happy for you. And I'm happy for all the guys in the prawn bay. I'm just not happy for me. This is why I want to change our arrangement. I fucking hate all of these people. I would dump somebody for, for, for a robot suit, though, honestly. I'm sorry. Natural Selection 2. Isn't that a real game? I fucking hate Altera so much. I was joking when I called them shitty capitalist Starfleet, but that's, they just genuinely are exactly that. Cabin 5. But I... This seems to be as far as we can go, except for this. Cabin 1. I don't... I don't think I have a hint for that. It may have been a hint in some other like life pod and I have to come back and But wait. But we haven't shut down the thing. We've got the Neptune escape rocket. Oh, it's by the Desert Synodic. I hadn't I didn't no idea. That's that's awesome. I'd heard of it, but I never played uh I never played it. Bitch. Um. <gasps> oh, for Pete's sake! It's like one ember. Oh, it like comes back. Fuck off. Gotta be more in the ship to explore, but I mean, there's some kind of like explodey reactor situation going on. And obviously, we're supposed to do something about that, but. It's like a prawn bay. Uh. Huh. Can't like open this bay, can I? I think that one room would like lead to like I assume I gotta get to the engine room. Hmm. And that wouldn't be through some random person's quarters, but the only way I could have gone. So I missed something back this wise. This is still the dorkiest flashlight ever. Huh. 
Huh. Yeah, the... Unless this does something. No? Maybe for the free overworld map of the game. Uh, maybe once I've seen more of the biomes. Didn't... Didn't I come in through here? Does the fire just regrow? That seems rude. What if I ran out of fuel? What if I ran out of... Huh. Rude. There's a fire extinguisher there, at least. Which also, which also means I made the fire extinguisher from nothing, basically, but whatever. There must be other places to get inside the ship. Um, cause like, it looked like I could go up here. Uh, I think. It looked like I could go around up here. Post like a link in the spoilers channel in the Discord. And if I need it or want it, I can take a peek, but I think I'm good for now. But I consider stuff like areas spoilers at this point in the game. But it'll come in handy once I've been everywhere, at least once. Is some reason to be up here, right? Oh yeah, there's, there's, there's got to be more. Yep. All right. Fluke that that one fire just came back because, like, I want to make it safer. Cargo bay three. Aurora systems are running on local reserve power, unable to remotely download black box data. Ah. Huh? Oop. I guess that means we gotta directly download black box data. Shit. Scans of damage to the Aurora do not match any known offensive technology. Ah, oh, damn it. All right, so we're probably missing the codes we need for a lot of this stuff. But we got the freaking prawn suit, so we are in really good shape now. Sucks about Poke Cord though. I just wrote a guide for that dumb thing, and some people joined the server because of it. And it's... broken. What? I, I hate these tiny little embers that still, like, f deal full damage. Ah, here we go. Altera launches the Aurora! Fritz reaches an inhabited space due to expand. The constructed. Oh, we're a capital ship! Carrying a phase gate bound for the. Alright. Oh, so we're trying to deploy a phase gate? Travel from a space dock. Nine different transgov authorities. Arrive on the far side of the Adrian Arm in three to months' times. Multi-trillion credit investment. 
So credits really are supposed to be like dollars, so I really do owe like millions of dollars for all the crap that I've used. Great. This is good with advanced thermal nuclear power facilities. Converts 9%. Wow. Capitalist Starfleet only operates 9% of all phase gates. <laughs> Outmaneuvered a cabal of Mongolian corporations. Operating a range of outposts and mines in the region. Uh -huh. Specifically Mongolia. That's a heck of a comeback. PDA data. Across the galaxy to install phase gates and just my resources. To install fancier phase gates. Are we trying to exhaust the galaxy or just ourselves? <gasps> Ooh, cargo bay code. 1454. Four. Eh, I'll take the third one, sure. Fires have been working, have been going on here and for weeks. Oh, hey! Bullsh. Huh. Exiting sleep mode. Loading voice recognition. Engineer Barkley and Chief Technology Officer Liu identified. Drone, get me a propulsion cannon. Propulsion cannon retrieved. Hey, Berkeley. Install that circuit box with that Berkeley. propulsion cannon and you'll punch a hole in the cargo bay. Damn it, drone. I said propulsion, not repulsion. Recalibrate sensors. Sensors recalibrated. Sensors aren't the problem. I tweak the program. It's like you now. It doesn't like being told what to do. <laughs> I know... His name's Albert now. Albert. I know <laughs> it's not your Amazing. Fault, but it would really help me do my job if you'd bring me what I asked for. Thanks for your time. Propulsion can retrieved. Thank you. Now go away. Entering hibernation mode. Boss, this hobby of yours isn't making my job any easier. Or safer. Maybe so, but it's all that's stopping me from being so bored I take a spacewalk in my skivvies. And then they blew up the cargo bay. The rendezvous was like, where was that? Fourteen five. All right, what's inside? It's more fire! Yay! Should have known it'd be more fire. Uh, it's always just more fire, isn't it? Okay, Cyclops engine. We just need two more Cyclops holes and we can make a goddamn submarine. Integrating new PDA data. Well, the largest supplies of faith. Defense contract, second century. <laughs> National motto get what you deserve. Most transgoes trace the response on Earth. It's the only one brazen enough to take its name. Turn the expansion on Terra. Supplied arms to all sides. <laughs> nice. Mass columns. Manufactured a corporate state. My favorite kind of state! Altera's uh, threat disease, trade wars, was the turning point of the conflict. Bring about the end of hostility. Yeah, I don't know what the deal with. I'll, I'll re. I'll mess with Pokecore tomorrow if it's still broken, I guess. For 
the enterprise with its terra space is encouraged, but competition is tight and all its goods. <laughs> all all goods exported off world must be Altera branded. Profitable businesses are bought out by this <laughs> profitable businesses are bought out by the state. Owners ascending to the board of directors. Well known Altera companies like Cyclops Submersibles originated with private enterprises. Wow. Reparations lawyers have always maintained that it's legal obligation to its employees, but voluntarily elects to take on the roles usually served by a democratically elected government. This claim has yet to be tested in Federation courts. Don't work for capitalist Starfleet. It's very different from the usual one. Basically Ferengis. No, I think I already got that. Yeah, I do. Alright, where's the hole? You gotta have the hole somewhere. What is it? Nutrient block. Delicious nutrients. Precious fluids. We're gonna finish through here and maybe make a prawn now nah, we'll, 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 we'll making the prawn will be what we'll do next time oh I was expecting to slide down but I guess not nutrient block. Do you guys like your nutrients dry or moist? First, I'm a big fan of moist. Oh, where's the Cyclops pieces? Drive room, Seamoth Bay. Can I go to Seamoth Bay? Damage wiring. Oh! Oh! I might have missed some doors before then. I didn't notice that that was a thing. I didn't notice you could just fix the door. PDA? Integrating new PDA data. Uh, this is the hollow bit, the hollow deck. Player three has been shot thrice, twice in the head while sleeping. Player two wins. Player two has died from cold and starvation. Amazing. Good game. Desert Island Drama. Vrat. <laughs> Player one washed away by an unusually high tide. Is this Oregon Trail? It's Oregon Trail with murder. Oh, free free depth module. I don't have any use for this at all, but I'll still take it. Seamoth fragment. I don't need that. Imagine getting this far without having a sea moth. It's probably just there for you know flavor reasons, but like, imagine that being where you get your you finally unlock the sea moth. I'm sure somebody did it. Dramatic corridor. Prawn bay. Locker room. This is where they keep the hot prawn. Shield your eyes from both the prawn and the welding. I don't think you actually take damage from that, surprisingly. I'll 
take that. Aurora auxiliary mission orders. Target the crew of the Mongolian vessel Degasi. Really? Last known location. So they knew those guys went down. Mongolian vessel Degasi appeared almost a decade ago here with high ranking Mongolian chief. Corporate insurance has purchased a board. Emissary Kassar, that's the that's the guy who died and was like praying to money, Jesus. During the fate of the crew will aid Altair's diplomatic effort with the Mongolian Council. Rose due to perform a slingshot maneuver. Three months post launch is to bring the ship within the range of the guest's last known position. Additional aquatic all terrain vehicles have included the Aurora's cargo package for this mission. So that explains why we have all of this like seafaring we just happened to have all this seafaring shit up aboard because we knew there was going to be an aquatic planet involved ideally they would have known that like bad things happened and like maybe don't go to the place where the bad stuff happened but yeah corporate rescue attempts sweet offer from huggins Telling me you've been on this river for more than a year, and you never took a ride on the outside. You're the gone and gotten yourself a friend with the keys to a giant freaking robot suit. Hell yeah. I taste the stars. You gotta get the only way my spare prawn suit's got your name on it. Oh hell yeah. Want to play catch with the passing meteor? Hell yeah. Oh wait, there that was a, there was a code in there. Uh, I'm not sure what for. I'm sure we'll find out soon. By the way, I, I love when, when games just have, like, there was just a, a woman talking to her girlfriend or wife or whatever that was. Um, Borderlands 2 was um, good and just, it just feels natural. It's not like, they don't try to make it a plot point. They don't try to make it, a, you know, something fancy. It's just, just, people can be people here. It's not some dumb bullshit, like, space evangelical bullshit. Is this not- oh, hey! This is just- okay. So we opened up, like, a- another way in here, so... I think... that might have been... Let me read that again. Come by cabin one! Yes! So this was... a thing. Didn't I fix you? I don't know. One eight six nine. Nice. What you got? What are you buying, stranger? Responsible autonomous relationships. All the good things in life are commodities. We trade love just as we buy and sell stock. God, Altera sucks. Engage in human relationships is the fish. Oh my god. Wow. Nothing good is ever free. Every physical good in the Re Federation came from a single supplier who constituted a dangerous monopoly. Personal relationships are the same! <laughs> oh god. It is important for people to get what they need from multiple sources. <laughs> If a person finds a better source of goods they require, they're they are not wronging their original supplier by changing their purchasing arrangements. Jesus fucking Christ. Ah, uh, space people. If one member of a relationship should feel rendered jealous, they must look at their own business model and ask whether it is performing competitively. God damn. Subnautic of the future fucking sucks. Yes, you you get Arcade Gorge toy. Uh, let me drop some stuff in the pile. Back in the pile. I hate how this stuff has collision. Um, I've got a couple posters. Let's just take one of each poster. And I don't need a titanium. And let's eat that water. Oh, 
Oh, we got a freaking blue cap. Can I wear the cap? Worst game. Boo! What is this? Arcade gorge toy. Comforting. At least I can, like, make a little display case with this craft, with the, the shelves and stuff. Alright. Ah, uh, shoot. I think we missed at least one door that I could have used a repair tool on. I don't know where it goes, though. I seem fine down here. It's gonna hurt my eyes. We're completely full on stuff, though, so I'll probably have to pop in here later. Regardless. Ow. So... Here. Sealed door. Yeah, I already did. There's a three-way branch here, so what's in here? Drive room. The drive core shield sustained internal damage during collision. Do not attempt repair without appropriate qualifications. Yeah. I've got all of the qualifications. Such as I can walk through fire now, apparently. So that's cool. Seems like a good place to be. Radiation yes. at maximum tolerable level. I have a new Cyclops thing. Uh. I was kind of expecting this water to like kill me with radiation. thing in Half-Life. Alright. No signal. Oh, don't tell me I have to go in the water. Oh. Huh? Drive course shielding bleach breach. Thick metal shell, continue to leak radiation surrounding the environment, the breaches a shield that dissipate over time. Appropriate radiation protected in a fully charged repair tool. Okay. So you're saying I probably shouldn't dick around directly in front of this, uh, this, this breach here? Oh, not the laser cutter! That'll, that'll be bad. Containment breach repaired. All right. Oh, what is that? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Wait. What? What is that? Fuck it. Get it. Get it. I don't. What? No. What are you? Bleeder. Sounds like a better name for me, actually. Why are you in here? Get the fuck out. Die. Fucking. Fucking thing sucks. Oh god. There's so many. All of the crispy sounds that they make. All right, well, that's fun and cool. Where are these breaches? I said there's like ten left. Oh, there we go. Containment breach repaired. Further breaches detected. All right, so we're fixing the frickin' Aurora, so that's cool. This will be a good, perfect time to end the stream, because, like, getting late and... Long stream for a frickin' weekday, isn't it? Four hours now. I guess it's where the sparks are coming out. Containment 
containment breach repaired. Further breaches detected. Containment breach there you go. repaired. Further breaches detected. Something like above water or something. Hi, friend. Yeah. Rip. Containment breach repaired. Further breaches detected. Okay, yeah, somewhere above water. Containment breach repaired. And there's another. So many. Man, screw. Oh. Screw the biosphere, man. These things do not deserve to live. Look at them. I, I, I hereby declare that particular creature does not deserve to live. Hey, Tuna. Um, so where's the last one? Yep, we're fixing the drive thinger. Breach repaired. Further breaches detected. Uh, where's the last one? Ah, there it is. I was hoping we would get the um, the Cyclops out of this, but two thirds of the way there. Extinction event averted! Yay! Drive core breach sealed. Radiant damage decreasing. By the way, good job aliens shooting down our ship and nearly killing your whole planet. Really good defense mechanism you've got here. Tip top shit. The Aurora is no longer going to kill us all, so that's cool. <laughs> like, it was the last room I somehow found. Alright, that should be pretty much everything. What was that? No, that's just a closed door. That's some titanium I dropped. Alright, I think there might be, like, one door somewhere that I mistakenly did not open. Uh oh. No, oh, never mind, we're good. <sighs> Can't believe there's only one Cyclops whole piece in here. It's not like secretly some up there or something? No. no. Oh well. Can't wait for this freaking weekend. Bit of a slow week. Alright, so. But double check something in the first place we went into. Administration. Pretty sure there was nothing else in administration, was there? I can I get the pen? No, I can't get the pen. How am I gonna be a fancy business person? Ooh, battery. Eh, fuck you, lead. I'm never gonna need batteries ever again, that's for damn sure. Got more batteries than your body has room for. Alright, so hopefully that is... I imagine that's the last of the places in the Aurora we can get into. Unless I missed a repair tool door. Oh god. Ha! <laughs> I'm glad there was water under that. Meant to do that. I'm gonna do one quick double check here.
Is that like a thing? No, I don't think there was any other door that I missed. Ow, my eyes. Nope, we checked it all. Alright, so there's some cosmetic crap in here if I ever feel the need to stick some stuff in my base, you know what I mean? Um, otherwise, Aurora pretty much handled. Got the prawn suit. Don't know what all we need to make it yet, but I'll take that. Uh, did you go FK or something? Yeah, we fixed the reactor. Drive core is all good. And before suddenly eaten by the Reaper. A little low level of detail. Oops. Um. Oops, sorry. <laughs> Alright. Back to base, and then we're good for tonight. No more radiation. Um, it says radiation levels will decrease. I don't know if that means I can take off the radiation suit. I don't have enough space to hold my radiation mask anyway. But it means the planet will not die from, like, radiation destroying the biosphere, so that's cool. I guess. That's mostly cool. Some of the things here I wish would, like, die in an unholy fire, but most of it is cool. That's right, Parker. Hi, Parker. Like, human, what the hell? Go to bed. Is your hair okay? Is your thing okay? Eh, never mind. He's got a... His hair's still growing back in a spot where he got a little cut. I'm always paranoid about it. The fur's are starting to grow back in. He just cleaned it weird and it like looked bigger, but it's not. Parker. Kind of in the way. Like, yes, I am here. I exist. I get the feeling the radiation poison is never gonna happen anyway. I, I think it's like an art like I don't think there's a real timer on it, fortunately, but still cool major thing in the game done. Excuse me? What? Psst. Explain that, atheists! Checkmate, atheists. I'm not sure if that's, like, I dropped a, one of those glow shroom seeds somewhere and it just, like, happened to grow there, or what the deal is there, but... That's a thing. It kind of tries to correct if you, like, try to do a flip, which sucks. But I guess works as a neat, like, quick turnaround maneuver if you want. I think my base isn't looking too bad. I'm really surprised how long this battery lasts. Sea glide lasts like three minutes. All right. Moist noises. All right. Well, let's see what it costs to make a prawn. Where do I even make a prawn from? From this thing? Prawn suit module. Um, Parker. Parker, I can't see, honey. Oof. There you go. Sorry to yawn, but it is past ten. Just talking about yawning, but it is 
jump jet upgrade. Interesting. But Cyclops. Like, where do I make the prawn from? Is it like a? Oops. Hello. Well, we'll figure out the prawn suit later. I, think I got so many batteries. I got double flashlights. I should probably just incinerate one of these flashlights. I'm never gonna need it. I got some food. I got some real delicious nutrient box. And some dumb posters I can put around. Let me put up my dumb posters. Like. Here. Um. <sighs> Gotta make it outside. There's probably like a thing. Maybe make it in the. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Yeah. All systems online. Did you just make it with this thing? Neptune escape rocket. Oh, this is where you make it. Cyclops, ingredients unknown. Plasteel ingot. Okay, it is expensive. Neptune escape rocket. Neptune launch platform. I don't think we'll be worrying about the escape rocket for a while. Hmm. I wonder if you can find some way to like deploy this thing underwater. <laughs> Just because this is kind of far from my base. Um, plaz steel. I might have the stuff to make that, but we'll figure out for sure next stream. Um, not sure, 100% sure I'll stream Friday. It depends on if Medicom is cooperating. But uh, this was a real fun stream. We got through the Aurora, we found a big pointy friend. We, um, did some other stuff. Built some new stuff for the base, mostly. But yeah. Hope to see you next stream. And hopefully we can fix Pokecord in the Discord. I don't know what its deal is, but... It's kind of some other Pokemon games for Discord that seemed... Look at that gate. Um, that seemed... That seemed, uh, like they might be better programmed anyway and have more features, so... Worst case, we might just use one of those instead. Look, this is a man who knows what needs to be done. He must do what needs to be done by him to defeat the enemies. That is a stance. That is a fucking stance. Anyway. <laughs> that tiny little tube. The tiny little tube somehow makes that shittier than if it was just free-floating, honestly. It's... I love it. It's beautiful. Alright. Good night, everybody.